Hey guys, this is the RPG Nomad and welcome to my playthrough of Deponia. This game actually has a very good story and I don't want to spoil any of it so let's just start. Start a new game. Uh, what's good about this game is that you can play it with just a mouse. You can just use the wheel and the two buttons, but I'll use the classic mode. Start with this Kuvak. Huh? What is it now? Wasn't the game supposed to have started already? Yeah, well, yes. But the junk press broke down, and we thought we'd use the time for a little tutorial. Who thought that? I don't need no stinking tutorials. So how are you going to fix the junk press? Just watch me and learn. Maybe you want to listen to what I have to say first? But you don't have anything to say. Oh, come on. It won't be long. Just point the cursor at me and left click. We'll see about that. Mm, actually, I think I will just skip the tutorial because I've already played this. Let's just get on with the story. It's kind of pathetic, you get all erratic About dirty dishes congesting the sink I'm tired of your bothers, remember our fathers They dwelled in a world filled with rubbish and stink But when all hope was lost, someone raised from the dust He was handsome and cunning, his haircut had style Courage was shining in his eyes As he said, screw you guys, mind your own business I'm off now, goodbye Huzzah, he's off now, goodbye Junk. Junk. And more junk. A life of order and happiness. Oh my bad, that was junk too. <clears throat> well, that does it. I need to leave this dump. Fortunately, this time my plan is foolproof. This time everything will work out. Where did I put my list? Heck, I really have to get away from this junkyard. Ah, here's my list. Let's see. Seems like I've packed almost everything I need. All I need now are some provisions. A toothbrush, a pair of socks, and a bolt cutter. A bolt cutter? What the... Well, guess I must have had a reason to put it on the list. So we have to find those things in his list. But we can also pick up other items. What's this? A sock? That explains why I've had such cheesy dreams. <laughs> cheesy. Okay. So we just have one sock. At least I already got one sock. But I need a pair. I don't want to show up in Elysium dressed like an idiot. Okay. So, the story is... Uh, our main character, Rufus, wants to escape Deponia because as he saw in this telescope. It is a world full of trash. And he wants to go to Elysium, which is like the utopia or something. So we'll, we'll just see if he'll get there. Another note from Tony. What's she complaining about now? Will you please clean the bathroom for once? Yeah, right, in her dreams. Tony's his ex-girlfriend. Oh, there's a plunger in there. Yeah. Here you are, toothbrush. Whoa! 
What? The, the toothbrush bailed out on me. <laughs> Guess I should have kept it in a more germ-free environment. Okay. Use the kind of oil in the wash basin. Yeah, let's get rid of this thing. Now we just have a drawer, an empty one. Okay, let's go get this. Come on, brushy, brushy, brushy. Come to Papa. Oh crap! I need a better plan to catch it. <laughs> well, what's that? A guillotine so I won't enter her room? Whoa, that girl has issues. I honestly wonder why we were ever together at all. Wow. <laughs> Stay out of my room. You have no business in there anymore. Who does Tony think she is? I've got better things to do than rummage through her drawers. But this whole house is Tony's. So, I don't understand. Okay, mm, let's go down. There are crumbs in this yeah. room. Seems there are still some wasabi peas in there. But without something to put them into, nah, I'm not collecting them. Okay, let's put it in the empty can. Yeah. Seems there are still some wasabi peas in there. I guess these will make good provisions for the journey. Okay. Next, let's get the pot. And the fork. Mm. Put water in the pot. Do the dishes already. They won't do themselves. Oh yeah? Well, I'll take that chance. You've scoffed all the food yet again. And I keep finding your crap in the fridge. What the hell's wrong with you? Huh? I don't understand the question. Ooh, another song. But it's yellow. So... They're not up here. Okay. I'll have a quick look. See if I can find something useful in the pockets. Hey, there really was something in there. A sock. Cool. So we got three socks. One, two, three, but their colors don't match. Okay, let's go here. You're not supposed to eat on the sofa. I keep finding leftovers in it. Huh? Well, isn't that a good thing? Mm, let's burn these notes. In the oven. Huh? In you go! <laughs> mm-hmm. Where's his hand torch? Okay, then let's put the pot with water. Ah, in the hot plate. And what else? Detergent. So what we're gonna do is wash those socks. I may not be an expert. But I'm sure I need a hot wash. Hot wash. Okay. So, as you see, the other one is blue and this one is yellow. Nope. Not no covered. second sock anywhere to be seen. Put it in the pot and look at what will happen. Ouch! Damn it! That's hot! Whoa, look at that! The sock changed color. 
Who would have thought it? But where's the other one? Clear case of subtractive color mixing. Yay, so now we have a pair. Uh, what else do we need? So we have the bolt cutter, the provisions, and the socks, but we still don't have the toothbrush. Oh yeah. Ouch! So we'll trap the toothbrush with this. Put provisions in here. <laughs> now the little bugger's in for a surprise. And yeah. Here you go. Oh sorry. Here. Come on, brushy, brushy, brushy. Come to Papa. Ha! Gotcha! Ha! Gotcha! I'll make you suffer the next time I brush my teeth. This is that thing. Okay, let's go back. And... Oh, no, don't close it. Put everything in here. It's okay. Bolt cutter, for whatever reason. Check. Mm -hmm. Provisions. Provisions. Check. Socks. Check. Toothbrush. Check. Ha! <laughs> Seems like I've packed everything. Oh, I can't close it anymore. Oh, seems like I've got to unpack something, but what? Mm, the biggest one is this. So I'll, I'll never be able this. to close the suitcase with a monster like that in there. I mean, I won't need a bolt cutter where I'm going. I wonder why it was on the list in the first place. <laughs> now it fits. Packed and ready to go. I think I just strained something. <laughs> hey, Rufus, you should save your energy for the unavoidable drop into the abyss. Yeah, thanks, Wenzel. You can save your sarcasm for someone less well-prepared than me. This time, I took everything into account. It'll be a stroll in the park. Ah, that's what you said last time. It took us days to remove the cactus spikes from your butt, remember? That's all toxic runoff under the bridge. This time, everything will work out. And when finally, an Elysian Orbit Pixie massages my back, I'll ask her to pause for a minute so I can laugh about you. Whatever. But say, can I have your stuff when you're gone? Yeah, sure, help yourself. As if anything on this dump is valuable. It's time for me to leave all this behind. Great. I hope you remembered to calibrate the harpoon. I'll do that later, after I've stored everything in the pod. Well, then hurry up. Well, you know that the Organon are always on time. Okay, so I guess we can cut episode one here. So thank you guys for watching. See you next time.